Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. If you're new to my channel, my name's Melanie and I do a variety of videos from daily, weekly and weekend food hauls, unboxing of beauty box, food subscription boxes, hauls such as TK Maxx, Superdrug, Boots, B&M and I unbox watches and trainers. So as you can probably see, today's video is the June's edition of Sourcebox. I'm actually really surprised it arrived today because I only got an email yesterday saying that it was going to arrive in, I think it was like three working days. So I got the email on the 6th and it arrived on the 7th. On the 7th, last month I got the email and I didn't get my box until the last weekend in the month. So I'm happy to get this already. So I've not opened it, so let's get right in. So the first item is ju jujube fruit stuffed with walnut, a sweet and nutty treat. Walnut stuffed jujube fruit, abacus. They are nutritionally balanced and taste sweet, crunchy and nutty. Enjoy as a delicious, nutritious and convenient pick-me-up. Really intrigued by this. I've never seen or heard of these before. So, definitely looking forward to trying them. Boundless activated nuts and seeds. Orange, ginger and maple. Orange, ginger and maple nuts. Boundless. A blend of pecan nuts, almonds, pe pumpkin and sunflower seeds provide a great dose of fibre and protein with flavours that pack punch. Pretty sure I've tried something by this brand before but because it sounds familiar but I do like the packaging. Love corn, habanero corn kernels, love corn. These crunchy corn kernels are a twisty savoury snack that at a tasty savoury snack that are sure to spice things up with a harabino kick. I do like things flavoured in chilli but my body doesn't. But it's not a massive pack so they're going to be interesting to try. Cultural Vegan Sausage Cultural Vegan Sausage Bio Style This brand new savoury snack is made with sprouted season, seeds and dried to 42 degrees. Retaining all the natural raw energy from the ingredients. Um, they look like dog treats, but definitely going to try them. Neat. A soft and chewy bar with cacao, coconuts and chia seeds. Cacao, coconut and chia bar. Neat. A soft and chewy bar with cacao, coconut and chia seeds. These bars are also free from nuts and palm olive. Really like the packaging of this one. Never heard of the brand, so I'm going to give this a good go. Banan Bonito Solar Dried Banana Bar. Original Bonito Mighty Bee. These bananas are grown in the rural Thailand and slowly tanned under a sustainable solar dome to keep them chewy and nutritious. It's quite um, a squidgy bar, so it's definitely going to be interesting to try this one. The Primal Pantry Double Espresso Protein I've heard of the Primal Pantry Double Espresso Protein Bar Primal Pantry A perfect afternoon pick-me-up or ideal for hitting the gym This bar is packed with natural caffeine and plant protein I've heard of the Primal pr Pantry I think I've tried some by them That came in a sauce box a while ago Hopefully this doesn't taste like coffee because I don't like coffee tasting food even though I do like coffee. Can't wait to give that a go as well. Nori, coconut and chia. Coconut and chia truffles, sweet exotic coconut truffles blended with juicy fruits and crunchy chia seeds, the ultimate indulgent. I love coconut and chia so I don't think there's going to be many in here but these are definitely something that I think I'm going to like. Primrose Kitchen, raw kale and cacao muesli. Raw kale and cacao muesli, Primrose's Kitchen. A wholesome combination of fresh kale and British oats, slowly air dried with cacao, sesame seeds, almonds and natural date syrup for an energising and nutritious mix. I got a big box of Primrose Kitchen cereal 
I think it was beetroot and ginger from a Degusta box and I've still not tried it even though I've had it at least three months. But this sounds a little bit more up my street. I think I'm going to have this for breakfast tomorrow. We made still lemonade. Still lemonade we made. Refreshing fruit to this lemonade. Refreshing with fruit to this lemonade is the perfect summer drink. Make sure to pop it in the fridge first. I don't like lemonade, but this is still so. Hopefully, it tastes nothing like fizzy lemonade. It tastes very lemony because I do like lemon drinks. I just can't stand lemonade. I'm actually so happy with this box. Like. I really want to try everything except for the vegan sausage but I will try it. There's such an amazing variety of things this month. I prefer this to last month's box. I have done a blog post about last month's box and what I think of everything in the box and that's on my blog and my blog's always linked in the description bar. I'll also be doing a matching blog post for this box in a week or so so please check out my blog if you want more information any questions please leave them down below and if you're new to my channel please subscribe and click the bell notification so you're alerted every time I upload a video I will be making a sauce box unboxing every single month until I get a box that I hate then I'll probably stop my subscription and thank you for watching everyone bye